All right, guys, it may come as a surprise, but I own a, I own a 95 Forerunner, and it's kind of my dream truck. All right, so I got this truck actually, like, probably six months ago, but I've been just kind of working on it and just getting it ready, and I haven't really made a video on it, but I got these wheels that I got off my grandpa, and I powder-coated them. Um, like that charcoal color and they have like decently new tires on them i did paint this truck the factory color that it was painted got a new windshield in it on the inside on the inside you know pretty basic i did have to go get a new steering wheel from a junkyard because the old one had a big rip down the whole entire side so there's nothing here um but i ended up installing a boss stereo with apple carplay and stuff and um the interior needs cleaned i bought these floor mats for it um but there is a cool thing my lights on my dash when i got this they have oh you can't even see it because it's daytime but they have blue and green lights here so it's pretty cool and you can turn them up and down it's pretty nice i as well got these cup holders here there's this cup holder that goes here and that cup holder that goes there because these cup holders suck real bad um then if we come to the back you know nothing too crazy back here it's still dirty but i have some floor mats back here got the seats and then behind this special little seat I got two 12s on a box that I built. There were speakers that were in my garage for a long time. Let me actually drop the rear window and I'll show you back there. Then back here, we got the amp and that's pretty it. much it. It's got a hitch stuff. I do have a brand new um, rear bumper as well as a brand new front bumper with the valance with brand new valance and a new fender here with the new headlight because when i got this thing it was hit by a deer on this side so the fender was all messed up here and bumper was so whenever i went and got it painted well me and my dad painted it whenever i did that i got a new fender and i painted it the original color and it looks really good it's a little bit dirty right now but it looks really good um, so yeah, this is kind of my dream truck. I plan on lifting it up maybe four or five inches and putting 33s under it. Um, but there's one more car while we're on the car topic that I just got the go ahead to, to be mine. So this is what I'm going to call my nice classic. It's a 1981 C3 Corvette. This thing, she's a little bit, a little bit dirty, but... This puppy is going to be bad to the bone when I get done with it. So, right now, we look in the hood. We got just a stock 351 with a, um, it's that FI Tech fuel injected car, like fuel injected carburetor. It's the 400 horsepower, um, addition. And, I have a great engine for in this thing because right now this motor isn't running right. There's some things with that, but I have an LS to go in here. So we're going to keep the carbureted though. We're going to keep it carbureted with that, but we're going to put an LS block in it with the heads and all that stuff, but we're going to keep it carbureted. Now, if you come on up top, we did have the T-tops, but the driver's side was leaking instead of spending, spending $1,200. We got the $500 one so it goes all the way across it's just completely flat um i will end up tinning this thing as well as my truck if i can open up this door give me one second now when we come on into the interior you know we got some seat rips i would love to get new seats for this thing and maybe some race seats or something we got some mustang um things in there from another car but when you come in here um, we got this yellow in here that's kind of messed up wood. You can see where there's wood behind it before. It's a little bit, it's a little bit messed up in here, a little bit dirty. We've had trees grow in here. 
There's a little bit messy. Passenger seat doesn't look too good. We got the Go EFI or the FI Tech. Um, see, I love. Let's see. To get a new, um, you know, I'd love to get a stereo that actually works. Get some, get a nice sound system. Because I also in my truck, I replaced. I did all new speakers and everything, but this is this is what I got to work on right now. This thing's got a hole in it, so I got a lot to do to this thing. But yeah, this is the car that I got to be my street car. Anything interesting in here? No, nothing at all. But because my original plan was to buy a Fox Body Mustang, but my dad told me. That if I put the money in to pay for the LS swap, he'd give me the car. Like, he'd let me drive it and stuff. So I was like, well, screw it. I'm going to go spend thousands on a Fox body when I got a Corvette sitting up here. So this is a car that you guys are going to see on the channel. You know, me restoring it. Um, doing the um, doing the engine swap. Um, we are going to paint it probably this same color just because it's been painted this color forever this is my mom's car and she loves it so i'm gonna paint it the same color get it looking all nice i'm gonna have me a nice corvette I've been riding, rolling, drinking, smoking, that's something I do. I've been hiding all of my emotions, that's something I do. I've been rolling around, I've been rolling around, that's something I do. I've been rolling around, I've been...